hello guys welcome again to my channel in this video i share with you how to prepare this honey face and body cleansing gel here i have listed out the ingredients to ensure a simple and efficient formulation process after preparing my work area and the required equipment i measure the ingredients needed you need a glass beaker or a container for mixing pour your distilled water into the beaker Take the glycerin, add the xanthan gum to the glycerin and mix until well combined. Add the perfume oil to the mixture of glycerin and xanthan gum and mix. Then pour the mixture into the distilled water. Make sure you mix as you pour to avoid the formation of lumps. If you do not mix while pouring, it may take about 1-2 to two hours for the lumps to swell and completely dissolve. If you add more than 0.50 grams of perfume oil or essential oil to this face and body cleansing gel, you must mix it with a solubilizer before adding it to the formula. Otherwise, the oil will separate from the rest of the formula. Add the honey to the mixture and mix. Honey works as a great anti-aging agent and moisturizer. It has the ability to absorb and retain moisture, which helps keep the skin well hydrated, fresh and smooth. Honey also contains enzymes, antibacterial agents, amino acids and lactic acid that gently cleanse and exfoliate the skin without drying it out. Add the cocoa glucosid and mix. Be gentle when mixing, else the mixture will become too foamy. Coco glucosid is a natural foaming agent and non-ionic surfactant. It does not irritate the skin. It is considered mild and can be used in a variety of products such as gentle cleansers and natural based formulations. I add in the betaine. Cocamidopropyl betaine is a mild and natural surfactant that cleanses effectively and is well tolerated by the skin. In surfactant mixtures, it has a slightly thickening and also antibacterial effect. It has a stabilizing effect on foam formation. According to the supplier, it is compatible with all surfactant classes except anionic surfactant at low pH. I add in the preservative and mix well. Because this face and body wash gel is water-based, I choose a broad-spectrum preservative that is also water-based. As this formulation needs to have the final pH of around 5, when choosing my preservative, I also choose one that works in this pH range. The next step is to test the pH value of the face and body cleansing gel. To do this, I mix 2 grams of the gel with 8 grams of distilled water. Then dip my pH strip into it for about 10 seconds. Remove it and see where the pH value is at. It is around 8 and 9. We need to lower it to around 5. To lower the pH of this formulation, I add 0.20 grams of citric acid to it. Mix well. After mixing, I test the pH value again. As you can see, we have lowered the pH from 9 to 5. This is perfect. You can now pour your honey face and body cleansing gel into a clean sterilized container and store at room temperature. The pH of 5 makes this cleanser very gentle on the skin. It can be used in the morning and in the evening by all skin types, unless you are allergic to one or more of the ingredients used. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like and share the video. I do appreciate your comments, feedbacks, and suggestions in the comment section below. Thank you again for your continued support. I wish you a blessed, beautiful, and fruitful day. I hope to see you in my next video.